Uh, sorry, I have a cold, but I'm going to be showing you today my uh, Game of Thrones collection uh, from a card standpoint. My uh, right house, uh, banner cards, autograph cards, just uh, the high money cards, and I'll show you all the autograph cards. So first I have this banner card uh, from House Baratheon, this piece of banner that they use in the show. It's pretty cool, I mean, matches the case, right? Oh man. Next is a shadow box card, which is pretty cool of Queen Cersei. Uh, it's a really thick card, it's like four cards in one. But yeah, it's, it has like a little map in the background and her picture inside the, the two cards. Next are just uh, the house cards, uh, Greyjoy, House Aaron. Next are the numbered uh, cards, like limited, out of like two or three hundred. Um, Rob Stark Gold Edition. Uh, Miss Sandiri, pardon my uh, pronunciation. This uh, King Joffrey and uh, Sansa Stark wedding card. I thought this was pretty cool, like the design on it, House Baratheon. Next is over a uh, $1,200 sketch card. Uh, there's only a few of these. Uh, there's only, well, actually, there's only one of these, these and I have it. Uh, I looked up the prices on eBay and the uh, websites. Uh, most of the dragon dragon sketch cards are uh, going for over a thousand to eight hundred. Most one I saw was four hundred, but uh, yeah, the artist uh, sketched it on a card. Pretty cool, right? Uh, now to the autograph cards. Um, I believe this guy got his head cut off by Denario, uh, whatever his name is, in season three. He was one of the masters, so I mean, it's pretty decent. Catelyn Stark's sister, uh, actress Katie Dickey. I mean, it's probably one of the ones I didn't want to get, but I got it. Oh well. Uh, the one, the only, Walter Frey, David Bradley. Uh, you know, he killed one of my favorite characters. Well, I guess was part of it, and yeah, man, that just. He just looks evil. Next one, uh, Julian Glover, Grandmaster Parcells, Pisces, I think, right? Yeah, Pycelle. Uh Yeah, I mean, decent autograph. Looks cool. Next one is uh, King of the Friend Zone, uh, Sergio R. Mormon. <laughs> My uh, Boston accent. Uh, Ian Glenn, which is pretty cool. I just pulled this in the season two. Uh, although I don't know what he's doing with his hand. Uh, I mean, you know, I'd, I guess he really likes taking pictures. The next one is really cool. I just pulled from uh, season one, actually. Uh, yeah, everyone knows who that is. Pretty cool. I mean, how dark it is. One of my favorite uh, autographs. Next one, obviously everyone, you know, I mean, she's so hot. Rose Leslie, Egret. Pull this in a season three box after buying two. I have a case on the way. Uh, but yeah, one of my favorite. Uh, <clears throat> decently priced, not my highest value card. I mean, you know, there are a few main characters in here, right? I mean, Egret, Hordor, King of the Friend Zones. But this one that sold on eBay for 475 the next one I'm about to show you. And I just pulled it actually today. Uh, so get ready. Oh, Amelia Clark, uh, season one. There's only 100 of these. Um, it's the most most expensive Amelia Clark uh, autograph cards. She only signed from season one and two. Uh, she didn't sign in three. Uh, Kit Harrington didn't sign in three. Uh, Rob Stark. Then sign in three, which is kind of weird, you know, because I was wondering, you know, he dies in that, so you'd assume he'd sign. But yeah, this, uh, this, the, this and the sketch cards, the high value cards, I mean, pretty cool, right? Uh, I have a case of season three coming in a few weeks. That's 12 boxes, so that's 24 autographs. So I'll be posting a video if you guys are interested. Uh, hopefully, I get, uh, like Stannis, Melisandre. Uh, Rob Stark's wife. Uh, in case you also have a chance to get uh, a piece of Rob Stark's uh, cape from the Red Wedding, which I think mean, is pretty cool. Uh, or like his belt buckle, not the buckle, but like the little straps.
and uh, yeah, the hound I want to get, but I mean, you know, the queen of all autographs right here. See you guys later.